This is Get Sellers Calling You, and I'm Beatty Carmichael. Learn more at our website at GetSellersCallingYou.com. Well, you know, you're absolutely right. The expectation you have coming into touching your personal list is really important. And here's what we find with agents. If the agent has a wrong expectation, they're going to quit early and not get results, or they're going to be inconsistent. So the best way to kind of describe what, hap describe what happens within your personal list and targeting it uh, is what happens with a guy in the desert. He's going across the desert. He's out of water. He's thirsty. He comes across this, this well with a hand pump. And there's a gallon of water sitting there, and it has a note that says, you know, pour the water down the well and prime the pump, and then start pumping. So he starts pumping, and he starts pumping, and what's happening is he can't see it, but the water is coming up, okay? Every time he pumps, the water's getting up. But then if he gets tired and he says, nothing's happening, so he stops pumping, the water goes back down. He said, well, let me try it again, okay? And this is what happens with consistency. You're consistent, and then you stop, and it goes back down. What you need to do is you just need to have the, the expectation that you'll do whatever it takes as long as it takes because this is the lifeblood to your long-term business. Okay, so you get on that pump and you start pumping, you pumping, and you pump, and then it gushes out. You pump and it gushes out, and it's every time you pump. Once you get the water all the way up, every pump is just gushing out. This is what happens with your personal contacts. Okay, so it's going to take a while to get started. What because what's happening is we've got to build up momentum and build up layers. Uh, marketing is a layered effect. Okay, every touch you do is another layer, and what we've got to do is build up enough layers so that that layer is thick enough. That when it comes time to call an agent or refer an agent, you're the only person that they think about. <clears throat> so when you first get started, most people haven't been doing a good job touching their list. And so it's going to take some time to get it up. Now, I know with what we do with Agent Dominator, which is really kind of a you know, uh, 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 touch system on steroids for your personal contacts, <clears throat> what we do is we, we'll guarantee in the first year seven sales out of a group of 100 of people that you know, okay? When, even when the average should be closer to 17 or 20 sales. But what's happening is that first year, it just takes time to start building up the momentum. You spend the first six months of the program just getting enough layers out there that they really start to think about you and recognize you more, recognize your expertise, I mean. And then it's that second half of the year that things start to really take, uh, take shape. But where you really start to get the gusher, okay, that starts to pour in the transactions is that second year. So the first year you're laying the foundation, you're starting to grow your business, but most of what's happening you can't see it because it's all in their mind and the layers of touches that you're doing. But then <clears throat> by the second year, we're now at full momentum. Okay, They've been touched now for a year. You're consistent. They're getting it. They're understanding you. They're understanding your expertise. That second year is where you, where you hit the gold mine, okay? and it starts coming in. So the most important expectation is just don't stop. Make sure that whatever you do when you're touching your list, whether it's with Agent Dominator or doing it on your own, that you give it a minimum two-year commitment because that first year you're laying the foundation, that first year you should make enough sales that you're making good money, but the second year is when it really comes in. And the other thing about the expectations, you've got to be doing enough touches. It's not 12 touches a year. It's not 20 touches a year. It's not even 30 touches a year. What we try to do is, you know, 50, 60, 80, 100, 150 touches a year so you can't lose. Okay, when you do that, it really starts to gush in. If you enjoy this training, please share our website. You'll find right down here on the bottom left at GetSellersCallingYou.com with other people. Also, be sure to subscribe to our weekly podcast. It's a 30-minute interview every week on everything you can learn about how to get sellers calling you. It'll absolutely put your business into overdrive. So you can subscribe to it at iTunes, at Google Play, and also at Stitcher. Thanks for watching and have a great day.